Top 10 Drones in 2024 In addition to being great tools for photographers, drones are a lot of fun to fly and offer a novel experience for pilots. In 2024, you can find high-quality camera drones for less than $500. These drones can capture breathtaking vistas from all angles. Perfect for anyone residing in suburban or rural regions, these devices offer a remarkable method to wow loved ones. Whatever your interest, drone photography, the rush of flight, or everything in between, we have suggestions for you. So in this video, we'll tell you about the top 10 drones in 2024, so stay tuned until the end. But before starting, make sure to like the video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. And now let's get started. 10. Autel Evo Nano Plus. Sub 250 gram options include the Mini 4 Pro and the Evo Nano Plus, the latter of which is a strong contender. With an ISO 3200 setting, its camera trumps the DJI Mini 2 in low light situations. With its dependable three-way obstacle avoidance and lightweight less than 250 grams, the Nano Plus is a formidable wind fighter. An improved and more user-friendly UI is now available in the Autel Fly app. The Nano Plus body isn't as sturdy as the Light Pluses, but it becomes more sturdy once the battery is installed. All things considered, the Evo Nano Plus is a top-notch mini drone that captures stunning 4K slash 30 per footage while still being easy to register. 9. DJI Avada in the increasingly popular realm of first-person drone flight, the DJI Avada is the best option. It records stunning 4K-60 footage and provides an outstanding FPV experience indoors or out when paired with a compatible controller and DJI goggles. Although there is an issue with the positioning of the microSD card port, our assessment emphasizes its solid build, crash resistance with propeller guards, and ease of flying even with little skill. A wide range of DJI controllers, from regular remote controls to motion-sensitive models like the RC Motion 2, make learning to fly a breeze. Aspiring FPD pilots will find the Avada, which can reach speeds of up to 60 miles per hour and capture unique footage, to be a good choice, with the proviso that they will need a spotter when flying outdoors. 8. Rise Tello A great drone for newcomers is the Rise Tello, which is both lightweight and affordable. With capabilities like hovering and programmed stunts, it has a respectable flight time of 13 minutes. While the 5MP camera does a decent job overall, it does have certain limitations such as visible compression artifacts when streaming 720p HD video. With this responsive twin-stick layout, the software is easy to operate. Although 100 measures is the theoretical limit, on calm days you can get away with 30 to 40 measures. Even if it has a short range and can produce choppy footage, the Rise Tello is still the best drone for beginners. 7. DJI Mavic 3 Classic To bring the price down from its more expensive sibling, the Mavic 3 Classic, the telephoto camera is cut from the cheaper model. Despite not having the scene editions 1TB SSD and Apple Pro is recording, this budget-friendly option is still a great choice for videographers thanks to its outstanding 4 thirds primary sensor, which can capture 5.1K footage. It may not be the best choice for novice pilots, but it takes after the original Mavic 3 models in terms of flying and safety, making it easy to control while avoiding obstacles and fallen things. Even though the actual 46-minute flight time is less, the Mavic 3 Classic is still the best option for anybody looking for a foldable drone with the best camera quality. 6. Autel Evo Lite Plus According to Autel, the Evo Lite Plus is the company's flagship drone, and it is designed to be a direct competitor to DJI's Air 2S. Despite having a 1-inch sensor that is capable of capturing 5.4K video at 30 frames per second, it is superior to both the Air 2S and the Mavic Pro 2 due to its 40-minute flight length and its customizable aperture, which ranges from f/2.8 to f/11. On the other hand, the Light Plus is an impressively adaptable flying camera even though it does not have the fourth axis stabilization capability and does not have some advanced video features such as a 10-bit and D-log profile or side sensors for obstacle avoidance. The fact that it has a sensor with 20 megapixels makes it a formidable competitor to the Air 2S, especially when one considers the pricing point. 5. DJI Mavic 3 Pro For aerial photographers and videographers looking for versatility, the DJI Mavic 3 Pro stands out as the premier choice. It comes equipped with three cameras. The 24mm 4 thirds primary camera, which is also found on the Mavic 3 Classic, outperformed the competition in different tests concerning frame rates, image quality, and adjustability. Offering 3x and 7x zoom options, the telephoto cameras produce top-notch results for a variety of situations. Even though it has professional capabilities, the Mavic 3 Pro is easy to use and has great safety features. However, beginners might find the price and advanced video modes to be too much. 
It offers a top-tier, portable, and less expensive alternative to the Inspire 3, with two telephoto lenses, and is classified in the restrictive C2 European drone category because of its weight. 4. DJI Air 3 An improvement over its predecessor, DJI Air 2S, the Air 3 has two cameras and better wind resistance. Since it is heavier than sub-250 grams drones, 720 grams, it is subject to stricter regulations in Europe's C1 category. Nonetheless, a generous 46-minute flying time is part of the deal. Even though the Mini 3 is smaller, it may be easier for beginners to handle. However, the Air 3 is a good choice because of its beginner-friendly interface and safety measures. As a reasonable option among DJI's drones, it strikes a good balance between price and performance. 3. DJI Mini 3 For individuals who are at ease flying without collision avoidance technologies, the Mini 3 is a great budget-friendly drone. Impressively, it offers the same high-quality JPEG and RAW still images as well as 4K video at a silky 30 frames per second, as the more expensive Mini 4 Pro, but being smaller and less expensive. Quick shots make up for the Mini 3's lack of log profiles and subject tracking, letting even novices take cinematic video with ease thanks to the drone's automated flying routes. The extra controller makes hovering easier and more precise with its downward vision sensors and GPS. The Mini 3's 25-minute flying time is sufficient for budget-conscious shoppers, although experts may find several functions lacking. 2. DJ Air 2S the DJI Air 2S can record stunning 5.4K video and 20 megapixel still images in DNG RAW format thanks to its big 1-inch image sensor. Its smart flight modes make it easy to capture cinematic film, with features like an automatic circling of landmarks and a follow-me mode for trekking. But you can't turn it into a portrait camera, which is a major drawback for making vertical videos. Despite being heavier and bigger than the Mini range, the Air 2S is user-friendly and portable with features including obstacle sensors, a foldable design, and a flight time of 31 minutes. In sum, its combination of capabilities makes it a top pick for flexible aerial photography. 1. DJ Mini 4 Pro A refined update to the popular Mini 3 Pro, the DJI Mini 4 Pro keeps the same small form factor, 249 grams weight, and a one-first 3-inch sensor for top-notch photos. More consistent video output with the D-Log M color profile and better low-light performance are two notable enhancements. Especially for newcomers, it's a safe and easy pick thanks to its omnidirectional obstacle avoidance and powerful active track 360 degrees. Although it might not be necessary to go up a notch from the Mini 3 Pro, the Mini 4 Pro is a fantastic choice for individuals who are new to the Mini series or are making the transition from another model. Adding the optional DJI RC2 controller elevates the whole package, making it a top-notch backpack-friendly drone combo. And that's it for today. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, subscribe to our channel, and we'll see you next time.